Yo, what's going on YouTube? Sprint here, bringing you guys another YouTube gameplay here today. Today I'm going to be talking about Advanced Warfare, uh, how esports is going to play out in Advanced Warfare, what I want to happen in Advanced Warfare, and what I expect. But before I really get into the main topic and everything, I want to give you guys a little insight on the gameplay. Pretty much, this was the Ace Lobby I played a couple nights ago. Um, we only got a couple maps, maps in because people kept on leaving and joining. It was just really stupid. Um, pretty much as any amateur ace, this is what usually happens. <sighs> but, um, you know, I did really good. This was actually a really neat gameplay because we played 3v4 and 2v4 for the majority of the game. Um, at least half, I mean. I would say probably more. And we still happen to win the side, uh, this half. Uh, we did not win the other side because it stayed to before and we lost only by like f like five or six or so It really showed something. I mean, I did really good this game. Uh, my slang was on point um, I really helped out the team towards the end getting some caps and some clutch kills, but um Pretty much that's it. I really don't want to go in too deep about the gameplay right now but um so right now I'm gonna get into the topic and pretty much what I'm gonna talk about is advanced warfare um pretty much from the trailer, Advanced Warfare did not look good at all, to me at least. Like, it's all personal preference, but to me, I did not really think Advanced Warfare looked too good. Uh, it looked really futuristic, like Halo, and I'm not really too much of a Halo fan. I mean, I played it a little bit, but I've always preferred Call of Duty over Halo, and it's because it's always been more basic. I think Halo's just too much, but um, personally to me, I just don't like it. But other people have their preferences, and um, you know, I respect that, but it's just not for me. But um, from what Nature and Big Timer said, they said that this game is going to be a sick game. Uh, it's really supporting competitive, so I'm hoping that's true. And, um, you know, if it is, it's going to be a really, really, really good thing for us, uh, for competitive to grow again. If they have hard point in this game, I'm almost positive this game will be good. Um, Black Ops 2, I did not like the game, but I loved how competitive it was. And it's because they had hard point. I mean, hard point made a huge difference, like... It was so, I loved Hardpoint. Hardpoint made the game pretty much. I mean, S&D wasn't even that good in that game. CTF is always CTF. I mean, CTF really isn't bad. I, I like CTF, honestly. It's just, uh, I like it better than Blitz just because it's more, I mean, I just like challenging game modes. S&D was so easy in Black Ops 2. Um, nothing challenging about it, really. It's all EMPs and all, all that dumb stuff, but... I don't know. That was just my preference. But I really think, from what I hear, esports is going to play out. But from what I've seen, esports isn't going to play out. So it's something I really can't have a for sure answer right now because I haven't played the game. I've only seen it and heard stuff about it. So I can't really judge my answer on that. But I hope what I'm hearing is true and I hope what I'm seeing is wrong. Uh, it would be a really, really good thing. But um, yeah. And now I'm going to move on to the last part of the topic. And that's pretty much just talking about. How I think Advanced Warfare is going to be in all. Uh, I think it's going to be a pretty decent pub game. I mean, Sledgehammer was made, help, like, helped M uh, Infinity Ward make MW3, apparently. And I loved MW3 for both competitive and um, public match gameplays and everything. I just thought it was an all-around good game. So, I mean, that, that really helps out a lot. I mean, that's just... A huge positive and if it's if if they were a big helper in that and making the game I mean I'm gonna be super stoked I mean even though competitive for MW3 wasn't big at all like it really wasn't a big thing um, you know I just I thought it was awesome I loved it I love the ACR the MP7 I think the best thing about that game was how every gun had a purpose and that's another thing I hope this game has balance uh, as you guys can see in Ghost, the balance was so screwed up. First of all, Domination sucks. I hate Domination. For competitive. I like it for public matches, not competitive. But, and Blitz is just, there's no challenge in it. It's pretty much just, you can run around the map and just score and win. You don't, you don't even need to slay sometimes. Like, you could just, and you can have a guy drop, like, seven kills when the rest of your team's dropping 30, but have, like, seven caps and win the game. I mean, that's just not realistic. So we're like, that's why I prefer CTF. So I hope they have CTF, which is already confirmed, actually. CTF is confirmed, which is a great thing for competitive. Um, I'm hoping hard point, if hard points in there, it's going to be huge. And S&D, obviously, is going to be in there. I don't know why they would take it out. But yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay. This was just my opinion on Go or not Ghost, uh, Advanced Warfare, what I think, what I hope, and what I've heard and seen. But um. 
you know, everybody has their own opinion, and I respect that. But this is just what I thought. And so, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay. I hope you guys enjoyed that three-piece. And so, yeah, this is Sprint, and I'm out. Peace.